Hallelujah. Better find Elizabeth before she lights out here. here, Snipe. You want to know what we do to pretty little stowaways? Or maybe you don't. Hey! hey just, Get away just stop for me. a minute! Stay away! I just want to talk to you! Elizabeth! Get away from me! Just hold up for Stay a minute! Away. I'm not angry with you! Hey, watch out! Move it! Move! Stay back! God damn it! Gotta be another way in. What up all, Darp here from Mindless Productions, continuing Bioshock Infinite. This is, uh, oh, 1999 mode without doing the vending machines and collecting all the infusions. I almost forgot all that bit. Anyway, this is the second of three major areas for the game. Uh, this is the Finkton area, more specifically the Finkton docks where we're at. And... I think this is my favorite. Well, no. I don't know. I think it's a, it's a pretty close tie between this and Battleship Bay. This, this place is just really cool. Very industrial. And you really get to see the seedy underbelly of Columbia. And it's pretty cool. I like it a lot. Um, Alright, so anyway, this is your first big fight. Everything else is just collecting and looking and looting and shit. Uh... Grab the sniper rifle, or if you have a lot of ammo for the carbine, and you're just more comfortable with it, you can keep that. I swapped out for the sniper rifle. But just stand up here on this first little dock, and just start, you know, shooting away. Every now and then, you may get one, maybe two guys that come on the rails at you. But for the most part, they'll stay down below and try to hit you. So, you don't really have to worry about it. And you can just sit up here and snipe till you run out of ammo.
I mean, you don't have a whole lot of ammo, but hopefully you've got enough to take out the, the guys down below. If you get nothing but body shots, you should be able to take out all but maybe one or two of them. But after a while, uh, an airship will show up on your right side like you saw. Just use possession on the turret to help take out the other guys. Plus, uh, anyone that's left will blow up the turret for you, so you don't have to worry about it. And then just finish them off. If you get to a point where no one is coming out and you can't, you know there's someone there, but you just can't seem to get them to come out, then you could hop down, just hop on the rail. Um, there's all kinds of cover down below. Don't worry about anyone up on that second floor yet. They can't even hit you from where you're at. So once you get the bottom floor clear, um, use the skyline to hop down. Don't just hop down because I think it does a little bit of damage to you. I think it's a little too far. So just to be safe, use the, use the rail. There's a carbine deer here to the left, and actually a pretty full carbine. Not, not completely full, but pretty damn close. A couple salts in the back areas. Little bits of loot here and there. And then the, uh, the little jail area I'm actually walking up to now, inside these doors, has an infusion for you. Which I pick up here in just a minute. Or now. I thought I waited. But yeah, there it is. And we're almost halfway through the infusions at this point, I think. Something like that. But anyway, feel free to go about looting. Um, there are a couple guys up top, but they can't really shoot down at you. So, when you're ready to go, just hop on up here. Doesn't matter which side you go on. Um, the big goal is to possess one of these guys up here. And I missed. Possess one of the guys. Either one, doesn't matter. It's better if you possess this guy, although he's a dumbass. Because uh, he's got the volley gun. So he'll take out the other guy pretty easily and then, of course, blow himself up. So yeah, that fight's done. You'll have to chase Elizabeth a little bit more here in just a second, but everything else is just looting and following her. Nothing challenging, nothing you can't just do. So I uh, will leave y'all to it, enjoy it, and I'll see you next video. No more. They say throw down your tools, they say. But I tell you, the moment you do, you will see what those hyenas are made of. I ask you, where are they going to be when it's cold outside and your boy's got the mumps and you've got nothing on your table but regret? D don't you see what the box popular is selling? They're selling dreams. And dreams, my friend. 